Hello, and welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy VI. Alright, so I sold my excess equipment well, last time. Since the previous episode, I bought another pair of earrings. And I rearranged my equipment and healed up. So let's, let's take a look. That's my equipment and relics right there. If I exit out of it too soon, well, you can pause. Anyways, now what we have to do is go over to the next town. And you can either walk there, or actually I recommend getting a chocobo here. It's 250 gold points. GP, sorry. But it'll be very useful because, well, I don't feel like walking there. And right there, there's an opera house, but it's closed, so... That'll be more important later in the game. So, alright, we had a little bit of traveling. There it is, you can see. So, let's head in there. And this is Zozo. Now, we can meet up with, uh, I think four different enemies here. And here is one of the most dangerous enemies in the game for right now. Now you want to just use drill. Any blitz, it doesn't matter. This guy can use um, magnitude 8, which is kind of like an earthquake spell. Where am I going here? And that'll do like 150 to 200 damage. And that is not good. So you want to be careful for that. Now I'll show you an enemy later where you can steal thief knives from, which can be useful. And here's a couple new enemies. You just want to use, where is it, Marshall on Gaw, and same as before. Maybe, ah, they're dead. Alright then. Now, there's a there's multiple towers here. You want to go into the cafe one first. Talk to this guy. Oh, okay. Oh, and we got a battle with another harvester. That guard ought to do. And he's dead probably. Alright. Got him. Alright, let's go up these stairs here. Alright, that was just another harvester. You want to go over to the right door first. And in this right door. Okay, in that battle, Edgar gained a level. And here we get a tincture. Alright, now we just gotta backtrack out of here. I figure I'll do it on screen since it's it'll only take me a couple seconds. Alright, and Sabin gained a level there. Nothing else of importance. Okay, now let's head up. And in here. Now what you're supposed to do is you're supposed to go around from in the town and talk to all the villagers and find out uh, what to put the clock at. But I'll just tell you, you want to do six, ten, sorry. I had to check my notes, almost forgot. And 50. And that opens up the secret stairs. What's in here? One of the best tools in the game, the chainsaw. Now, I'll quick show you what it does. Huh. Huh. I, I don't know how to look at tools. Okay, here's the enemy you want to steal from. You can steal thief knives from them. It's a rare steal. And yeah, he they can use bolt 2, ice 2, all those kind of things. That's why I don't think it's necessary to waste your time and die trying to get the thief knife. But that's just me. And holy cow, I gotta kill this guy quick. And Edgar's dead. This is not going good. Okay. Um... Too Marshall. Wait. Yeah, let's do Marshall. Come on, kill him. You can do it. 
Yes! Okay. Now I'll take a second, and I'll heal up, and I'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. Had a bit of a scare there. Yeah, I might as well just... God, this encounter rate is ridiculous. I might as well keep this one in. Come on. That's all the new enemies here, so I'm going to start editing all of them out now. Because it would just... I don't want to keep... Ooh, we got a barrier ring. I don't want to keep repeat battles in. They just waste the time. So, anyways, let's go down here. Just a Hades Gigas. He cast a uh, Magnitude 8 on me and almost obliterated my party. <laughs> so, let's play it a little risky now. Alright, you want to go... Jeez, maybe I actually should have brought in Celis. Good lord. I'm getting my ass kicked. Hmm. Okay. Ooh, what the hell is this? Yeah, I noticed that too. Okay. You just want to follow these guys up here. Come on, beat him. There we go. And yeah, let's go up here. Now, I might miss something here. I might miss something here because I'm not really sure. I mean, I've done test runs of here. And there we get the Thief Glove for lock. No, I'm doing the wrong thing. What the hell am I doing? Thief Glove. There it is. Yeah, it changes the steel into capture. And what the capture does is it allows you to use the fight command while you're stealing. So you could use that with the Thief Knife and the Sneak Ring. And... You'll be doing some damage, but I don't think that's necessary. We don't have really anything to steal. So, let me just quick heal up here. Okay. Should be good. Now, there's one more treasure I want to get. Oh, I guess I can't go in there. Alright. Okay, you want to go up here. And you can jump from building to building. And go in here. Here, talk to this guy. Oh. Yeah, well, we already did that, so. Alright. And up here. Check these out. And we get a tincture. Awesome. Let's head out. And up here. Hey. Oh, yeah. Well, like I said before, we figured that out, so. Why they're telling us stuff we've already gotten. I have no idea. Alright, I'm heading here. And up here. Alright. There we go. And if I didn't mention before, that chainsaw tool that we got, it has a 25% chance of randomly dispatching your enemies, so instant death basically. But if they're immune to instant death, well, then that won't happen. And there we get the fire knuckle, a weapon for Sabin. That's the one I didn't think I that I think I miss. I don't know why I did, but all right, now let's head up. Yeah, head in here. Oh, well, there is no door there. Why is there no door there? I don't know. For boss time against Dadaluma himself. Now this guy is a pain in the ass. Unless you have Darkwind. Then you are golden. And I probably should have healed up Locke before this, but oh well. Uh, I'll show off Chainsaw here. You want to use Aura Bolt. And just attack on Locke. And lock. Oh, thank God. I thought he was going to die. I was about to say, and lock's dead. Now, see, he has the. You can randomly use the break. Huh? I thought that would have worked. Whatever. We'll get him soon enough. This guy can be a pain in the ass sometimes. He can. Use potions on himself. <clears throat> Excuse me. Oops. 
There we go. And we got him. Awesome. What do we get for our efforts? A headband. How useless. But what awaits us up in this door? Will Terra be in there? I don't know. But find out next time on Let's Play Final Fantasy VI! This is RPGLPs, heading out. I'll see you next time!